A seismic shift is unfolding in the MLB, and with it comes the biggest change in the MLB in many generations. Guys, the days of seasoned veterans dominating the sport are no more. Young phenomenons armed with talent beyond their years are not just knocking on the door of greatness, they're bringing the whole house down. With each swing of the bat and every blazing fastball, they're sending shockwaves through the league, leaving seasoned veterans shaking in their cleats and already considering earlier retirement. 39-year-old right fielder Adam Jones was quoted saying, The game's gotten harder. It's like that line from Cars 3. The youngsters will tell you when to retire. The next generation's here and they're really good. He wasn't kidding. Let's take a look at which young stars are most ready to get promoted from the farm system and take over the MLB. The first in our young studs lineup ready to change the league is Paul Skeens for the Pittsburgh Pirates. The 2023 number one overall draft pick played college baseball as a right-handed pitcher for the Air Force Falcons and the LSU Tigers. In his lone season at Louisiana State University, Skeens posted an incredible 1.69 earned run average and set a single season school record for strikeouts with 209. At 20 years old, he received Southeastern Conference and National Pitcher of the Year honors, as well as the Dick Owser Trophy. Skeens was part of the LSU pitching staff during the team's 2023 Men's College World Series Championship win and was named the tournament's most outstanding player. He's had limited time in the pros, with less than three innings pitched at the AA level. But with the Pirates having some holes in their starting rotation, he should at least be looked at as an option if the Pirates are competitive this year. Taking second place in our listing today is Jackson Holiday for the Baltimore Orioles. The first overall pick in the 2022 draft is ranked as the MLB's number one prospect playing the infield position. Holiday has long shown potential from junior year, batting at 500 with six home runs and 50 runs batted in. Holiday has shown tremendous talent in the minor leagues last year, with a 323 batting average, 12 home runs, and 74 RBIs. On top of all this, he had 24 steals with an impressive 442 on base percentage. He's still very young at only 20 years old. But with these figures rolling, he will definitely get a lot of playing time in spring training. And with the Orioles being a generally young team, they may not shy away from calling him up this year to try and top their 101 win season last year. Making it to third on the list is Ricky Tiedemann for the Toronto Blue Jays. Ricky played the 2022 season as the Blue Jays' top-ranked left-handed pitching prospect and was assigned to the Dunedin Blue Jays for the single-A Florida State League at the beginning of the 2022 season. He went 3-0 with a 1.80 ERA, 800 whip, and 49 strikeouts in 30 innings, pitched over six starts with Dunedin. His performance got him promoted to the Vancouver Canadians of a high-A Northwest League and then to the New Hampshire Fisher Cats of the double-A Eastern League. The fourth prospective star on our list is Kyle Manzardo of the Cleveland Guardians. Kyle was drafted by the Rays in the second round, coming in 63rd in the overall 2021 draft. He plays the first base position. Despite having a disappointing 2023 season with only a 2.37 average and 17 home runs, Manzardo is still ranked as the number two prospect in the Guardians organization. With his growth in power over the last two seasons and impressive bat-to-ball skills, he could provide Cleveland with a much-needed power boost at the first base or designated hitter DH position. Meet our fifth prospect, Mike Vassell of the New York Mets. Vassell was drafted in the eighth round of the 2021 draft as a right-handed pitcher. Vassell made a great start for the team in Double A last year, posting a 3.71 ERA in 10 starts. Despite his struggles after being promoted to Triple A, Vassell is tagged as the most likely pitching prospect to come out of the Mets farm system this year. And with a team that will need significant help on the pitching side of things this year, a good spring training could get him a ticket to the major leagues. Number six on our list is Dylan Cruz of the Washington Nationals. Cruz was selected as the second best overall outfielder by the Nationals in the 2023 Major League Baseball draft. Cruz being a new draftee is expected to make his major league debut at some point this year. He is the number one prospect in the Nationals organization and fourth ranked overall in all of MLB. In the minor leagues last year, he had a 292 batting average with five home runs and almost 30 RBIs. 
the struggling Nationals should be looking to him to boost their lineup this year. We have number 7 on our listing is Jackson Chorio of the Milwaukee Brewers. Unlike other prospects, this outfielder signed as an international free agent in 2023 and was not drafted. 19-year-old Churio is currently ranked as the MLB's number two prospect. He put up great numbers in AA last season with a 280 average, 22 home runs, and 43 steals. His talent did influence the Brewers to sign him a whopping eight-year, $82 million contract. In the history of baseball, this is the largest contract given to a player with no major league experience. Number eight in our listing is Jordan Lawler of the Arizona Diamondbacks. With the position of shortstop, Lawler was the sixth overall in the 2021 draft. Lawler already made his big league debut with the Diamondbacks last season, and while he struggled at the plate, making four hits and 31 at bats, his defense took a pleasant turn. Although it may look impossible, Lawler is most likely to find himself in the big leagues this season and will land on the opening day roster. Last but not least on our list is Nick Frasso of the LA Dodgers. Playing the position of a right-handed pitcher, Frazzo was drafted as a fourth-round pick by the Blue Jays in 2020. Frazzo indeed has impressive raw stuff with a four-seam fastball that touched 100 miles per hour. His career strikeouts per nine innings are over 11. And last season, he had a 3.77 earned run average in 25 starts. With a Dodgers rotation that will look a lot different from years past, Frazzo has every possibility of having a big impact on his career whether it be as a starter or a reliever. These young studs are promising players with great potential at such a young age, and we expect big things from all of them. Comment who you think will be the best player on this list. And following the theme of new faces sitting on baseball throne, don't forget to check out our previous video on why the World Classic is better than the MLB. Otani strikes out Trout, and Japan's back on top of the baseball world.